Okay, this is a follow-up from after I baked my card. As you can see, it's doing its tests. My video card now fully, it's functional and put back together. Down here, as you'll see, video card is back in place. All components are hooked up. Attachments and make sure you put the thermal paste on there. And then once you put it back together, these will look, they'll look just like these, you know. All perfect. And they all work. These are all the Dell X, the biggest laptop ones. Detachable wireless keyboards. So these things are worth fixing if you know what you're doing. And as you see, they're all booting up. All of these had bad video cards. And now none of them have bad video cards. So once again, baking really does work. Right. The one I just did in the oven that you saw earlier in the other video works perfect. It's doing its tests right now. The memory, the graphics test as you see right there. Video card connection test. Perfect. LCD connection test. Inverter test. Graphics test. 100% passed. Of course, though. So, I left mine in actually a, a few minutes extra longer because the woman called and I kind of got spaced. But, I'm not going to argue. It works, so maybe it was good. Just make sure you let the video card cool down. I tried to put the video card back in real quick after it kind of cooled down, but the system still thought it was overheating, so it did tell me that it did get to its temperatures inside exceeding what it would normally be if it was on. So that told me that the solder points worked. And I wish you all the luck. If you need any help or any advice, I've done so many of these cards. Feel free to message me back. I hope this helps.